Hey guys, welcome back for another one. We're seeing here with Transport Fever 2, our Apex Challenge. Every product to every city on a tropical map, 1850 star, hard difficulty. Uh, you can see the farm in the background, the, oh, the line we put in uh, last episode. But we're moving on from food in this one. We're moving into construction materials. So at this point, let's give a little update here. We have completed food to every city. We have completed fuel to every city. We completed tools to every city. We still have construction material, machines, and goods to go. And we're going to be focused on the construction material as our next leg of trying to complete our apex challenge. Um, I did pretty much make sure everything was balanced out between episodes. Everything looks good to go. And now we have to you know, start the challenge of getting structure material to every city. Now, when I say to every city, it means that every city that currently demands that good, it's being delivered to, doesn't mean that it's in actually literally every city as not every city demands all six goods, just the way the game goes. Uh, we are in the year 2005, so we are in end game status, which means that at any point I hit my objective, we are done with this challenge. Anyways, uh, so let's focus on where is Christian Joe currently being delivered to and where is it demanded that we're not delivering to. So the first deliver to we have Palm Bay is covered. We have Ever covered and we have Winston Salem covered. I believe that's it for the north here. Gresham demands it does not have it. Uh, Madison demands it does not have it. Uh, no demand from Richmond. Uh, we have a demand from here from Torrance, but they are getting it. And, and it's from the second um, production line of construction material, which probably should be an indication that close to Richmond that Richmond wasn't going to demand it. So, you know, that's that. Uh, we do have, so on our map here, we still have in Lancaster who does demand all six goods, actually having all every good delivered to it, except for construction material. So we got to remedy that. So that's kind of much where we're at. Uh, we do want to go through and all the lines that are currently being delivered to make sure they're updated. So that's what we're going to start with first. Every existing connection, we have four different connections that we need to go and check and get them updated to make sure they're running efficiently, efficiently here in the late years. Um, so let's start where let's start where it all began down here with this connection here going to the ship. So uh, first things first, uh, we definitely need to do a bunch of upgrading to. Uh, to really make this good. One thing I do like about construction material, and it's the only one that's really unique like this in the entire game, is you produce 400, and if you go to your construction material um, plant, its demand can reach 400, and it's a one-to-one -one ratio. So unlike the rest of them, when you need to connect like two and like two for one, like all over the place, this is the one where it's just one-to-one, -one, and eventually the construction material plant grows straight into it. Now we're going to have to do some bulldozing here, unfortunately, because, uh, this is not, this is not optimal. This, you got the slowest vehicles possible. Yeah, yeah. We got the slowest vehicles possible and we just need to update the, the, everything here. Uh, so first things first, let's see what we can do down here. Um, country roads upgrade. All right, cool. It will allow me to get right there, which is sweet. Um, this is where everything gets messy down here. And this is what I do need to update. So we are going to press pause here real quick. Cause we're going to destroy our connection. Oh, did it again. I always do this. Can I delete things in random order and, and don't realize that there's vehicles on here and you have to move them all out of the way. All right. So let's go ahead and grab. I think we can do just a regular road here. Cool. Now bring your larger road right on in. Alrighty. And that definitely should be too far away to connect from the dock up there. Cool. It is. All right, so now we're going to go ahead and put in, we're going to put everything back, I should say. So we need our truck stop back in. And then we'll need to put our depot back in. Um, all right, actually, we need to make sure. All right, so we need to make sure, I'm thinking too hard. Um, I need to make sure that everything's connected because I believe we dropped construction material off to this depot and I need to make sure it's close enough that it connects to the train station. So uh, I need to put everything back to make sure that we get this connection. Oh, um, I'm trying to get a fancy little curve in here. I might be, I might be trying to do it. I might be trying to get too fancy. 
All right, let's try. Let's try. Curve. All right, so we need to make sure. All right, truck station. Okay, this is uh, this is very important. All right, it is connected there, but I think what I mm. yeah, if I can get it just to connect. Okay, it looks like it's gonna connect. Just need to make sure that it connects. Just won't go straight. I hate it. like I have to go out here to get it straight, but I want that connection right there. All right. So. All right. So okay, we still can have the drop off. Good. It's all I need to make sure we can have. All right. So depot needs to go back. Oh, not the tram one. I don't think I need it, but you know it's good to have it there. All right. So next things next, we need to upgrade these guys. Got to delete a lot of them and then upgrade them. So I can go back to pressing play now. The line should have fixed itself. It did. All right. So manage vehicles. We're just going to randomly delete almost all of them. Uh, we need. We probably can get down with just. We can probably get away with. Just, actually, we'll get it down to five vehicles. And let's upgrade them. And survey says 510. Well, maybe I'll go with. Well, if each one does about 100, I'll probably get away with one. Let's go with that one. All right. No need some time to spread out. Let's go ahead and fast forward here. Like I said, we just need to go through. We just need to update and make sure everything's working properly. Um, yeah, let's that be. I'm going to check out these ships real quick. I think it's the next step here. Ships are well above 400. Um, I wonder if I can upgrade these to something else. What's the upgrade here? All right. So currently you are, you are this one. So you're going 30 knots at 2020. This is 32. I maybe I'll go with just one ship. All right. So what I want to do is when this one docks, I'm going to del I'm going to delete it. Come on, faster, 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 faster. We're going to delete you. We're going to cause mass destruction here. Empty, 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 empty. Nope. Dang it, you load too fast. Dang, you wiped me out. Could have done that on one time speed. Maybe there was enough time to react. All right, replace you with the next biggest thing. And that should, I just need a rate of 400. Can you give me a rate of, oh. all right. I'm hoping that fingers crossed that number gets better. I'll leave a beef right now. I'm, I'm fingers crossed that it does get better. I really hate to have two ships on this line. If I can get away, if I can get away with just one, I'm really hoping the speed just hasn't been calculated yet. We'll, we'll see what happens. Um, make sure this one is above 400. It should have calculated by now. It's not. All right, five it is. Come make me happy, make me happy. You're not making me happy. Um, all right, let's focus on here next. This one's gonna be a mess because this is so close. Um, the easiest thing for me to do is easily just, oh, I wish I could just pick this up and move it. Unfortunately, this game doesn't allow me to pick anything up and move it. Um, I think this is gonna get deleted, so we're gonna go ahead and put this in. I'm going to go ahead and delete the stuff that's going to cause me problems first. And that still works because that connection right there um, will connect over here and still drop things off. And I need that deleted because I need to put a new line in here. Unfortunately, the train tracks ain't much going to be able to do about it. Um, all right. So it looks like we're okay. Did you give me a better number yet? 380. You, get, you keep getting better. I'm, I'm, I'm holding out hope. Holding out a lot of hope here. All right. So we need to do is we need to press pause. We need to delete this. Uh, did not think this one through. Oh, 
Oh, dang it. They put them. Why did you just put them on the truck stop? For real. I gotta put this back, actually. Uh, one of these days, I'll calculate this all right from the start. There we go. Now they're all out of the way. Alright, so first things first. Let's get the flattening tool out here because I'm afraid this is not. You went up instead of down. There we go. That's better. Alright, so we want the fastest road possible. Too close? Must be, but now I feel like I'm too far away. All right. So first things first. The collisions. These the signs right here. Um, they're too close for how wide the road is. We'll just get rid of them. We'll put them back then. I really hate these train tracks. Yeah, we'll make them like that. Hmm. All right, let's put the let's put those signals back in. I don't know, guys. I don't know. They should probably be one way, and they're probably not. dock go ahead and add in a smaller road and we'll go back to our bigger one get a curve one I'm just gonna go point a point B let it do its damage which is a lot of it um nope oh, I want tunnel have you bend up a little bit. All right. And let's see if we can smooth this out. Cause this was the first one where it's like, people are going to know I didn't work with the terrain. We can't, we can't have them knowing, right? No one can know. It's our little secret guys. Our little secret that I did not work with the terrain. Well, not all the time. I don't know. I'll leave it up to your guys' opinion. <laughs> how much I worked with the terrain in this playthrough. All right, let's get it, get it, get it, get it, get it, get it. Come on, smooth, 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 smooth. Come on, nice and pretty. All right. There we go. Let's go ahead and put it back in our uh, truck stop. Uh, we do need to reconfigure this. I'm going to make it cargo. I'm going to make it one more wide. And we see a bunch of these. I hope that's enough capacity. It is. All right, so we have that. Then we need to have a drop off. Mm. All right, what I need to do here is I need to go straight. do for now all right so now what i need to do is get my depot back in um which i don't remember if it was a one stop or a two stop i believe it was a one stop <clears throat> all 
I want to get you kind of down close to. Smooth it out. Cool. All right. So everything's fixed. Good, good, good. Go back to pressing play. Um, I don't know what to do as a ship though. I believe enough time has passed where it should recognize and it's not, or it should give me a rate higher if it's going to, and it's not, um, Kind of sucks. I really don't want to do the tugboats. I've had the tugboats before and um, there seems to be an issue with it hauling stuff. You know what? I might just... Uh, I wonder if there's another ship that's going to be on its way on, uh, coming out. Anyway, I'm going to let this be at three... Oh, 395. Okay, it's getting close enough. I think I can chill a little bit. Um, anyways, what's going on here? Why don't we... All right, so you guys, we're going to shrink you guys down. Manage vehicles. Let's get you down to two. All right. And then let's replace. And I believe two will get the job done or not. Oh, shoot. Oh, sorry. Did I make it? Yeah, I made one over there. All right, let's do another one. I don't think two's getting the job done. The rate was really... I need a rate of 400, guys. All right, there's 305. All right, let me put one more on. Yeah, I really miscalculated that. All right, there's my 407. Okay, I'll check on it then later and see if it really is overkill or not, but we're trying to rebalance out. I say, okay, so now that production's good. Uh, we're not messing with the trains in this on this setup. We're going to assume the trains are good to go. I know I have messed that with the one that goes to Everett uh, and the one that goes to Winds of Salem. So those parts I'm not touching. I'm going to let those be because those are inner city issues and not uh, production line issues. The next thing that I want to take care of is uh, the ones that are going into Palm Bay. Palm Bay, I'm pretty sure they're old. Um, and now that we have Depot built, we can get rid of this one. Go to some roads here. Um, cool. I think what I'm going to do is just update these roads. Um, so you can definitely go faster. I think I'm gonna, I'm, I'm gonna let go of my uh, having to go 100 kilometers an hour and just take the 80. You guys get a little faster going in town. I know you're going to delete some. It's fine. It's fine. Leave it be. Leave it be. All right. All right. Let's upgrade you guys. How is our rate here? We have a rate of 166. All right. Let's replace you. I should just replace you with one of these because I don't think I don't think I want a big big truck going in which now in hindsight I probably shouldn't delete it so much uh, 123 actually 123 is not bad you can do a little better I, we put a depot back down since I've I definitely done some some damage I've done some damage The depot back down because then you put people back and we have all right let's definitely manage vehicle throw another one back on all right 156 i can live with 156 all right that makes that a little better <sighs> all right so that takes care of that connection we have going to palm bay everett and winston salem we are running out of time this episode so let me go ahead and focus on the one we have down here this one should be mostly up to date uh we have I think these are the newer trucks. So stone construction back and forth at a rate of 200. Uh, do we have an upgrade here? No. All right. So we can't really do much. Um, <clears throat> but we should see growth as soon as we connect this up to some other stuff. So what we're going to do, um, actually just take a look at construction material into torrents. 
I think well, here's another one where I'm, I'm not going to worry about. Yeah, I'm not going to worry about uh, putting the big 18 wheelers on. I'm just going to update these guys uh, to the newer vehicles. You just need one of this construction material only. Cool. Gotcha. All right. And that should give me a, that gives me a rate of estimated 50 currently. And our demand is 55. All right. So we should see a big improvement there. Um, all right. All right, guys, we are good to where we need to get to right now. Actually, I'm going to cut this episode a little short before we get into the projects, but we have updated all our lines. So I know we didn't do much here, but we did do some updating, um, just to have some faster movement of product, a lot of lost vehicles, um, and also keep that profit margin way up. As you guys can see, I'm just cranking in the money on hard difficulty. Now, unfortunately you do have to be in late years to make this stuff happen. You will not see this return of profit. If you constantly, if you just leave the game at 1850 and try to do all this, you will not see a profit number like this. It's where the like late game vehicles are really more profitable than the early game vehicles. All right, so we are going to do some extension. Uh, let's give you guys a little teaser. What we're going to do next episode. Uh, so the first thing we're going to do here in the next episode is we already have a line coming down here. We're close to where Madison is delivering tools down and it's going back empty. Guess what? It's no longer going to go back empty. It's going to go back full of construction materials. And if you want to see how I'm going to hook that up, you have to come back for the next one. So guys, before you go, give me a thumbs up, subscribe if you've done so already, turn on the notification bell, and don't forget to leave me a comment. And like always, I'll catch you guys on the next one. Bye.